A while ago, somebody called Deep or Dolphin reached out to me during one of my streams, claiming he'd made a self-driving train in Stepford County Railway. Now, you might remember this video from a while ago, where they used a recorded clicking pattern in order to drive a train. However, what Dolphin created was a system which looks for specific pixels on your display and carries out actions based on that. But I'm not the one qualified to explain it here, so let's hear it from him. Got to line up the UI with the little black box. Need to run the auto AWS script and then the auto arrival Stepford Central script. If I know, so I'm now holding W, accelerating it. Can't stick to speed limits, but we don't have to worry about that because derailing doesn't exist yet. So, fingers crossed, the script should now be looking for 0.12 miles remaining. And then when it sees that, it will wait for a few seconds, slow down to 5 miles an hour, and then very slowly creep to the buffers. Should have a little... There you go. There's a little slither of green at the bottom of the throttle. It slowly creeps forward. it detects the red light on top of the buffer until that's a specific size and then when it finds the correct size it'll stop and open the doors. Didn't you say um, the other time that, um, that at Lynn one of the platforms is quite tight? Every single time you go into uh, is it, it's like platform 10 or platform 11 it's quite tight. Yep so it's now automatically enabled the auto departure script which means that when it detects the doors are ready to close, it will close the doors. Then it will wait until the doors are closed uh, before it will accelerate. And that way it works with guards as well as dispatchers. Um, nice. So unless you know that the train's running automatically, it's quite difficult to tell. And so we continued over to Morganstown. It worked absolutely flawlessly apart from one small hitch at Ellesmere Junction. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine, when you're not really fine, but you just... And we arrived at Morganstown without dying. Now, I wanted to have a go at this myself, but I had a bit of a problem. His screen had the taskbar at the top, and you can't set it to the top with Windows 11. Or can you? I looked up some instructions from a Microsoft thread, and managed to edit my registry on my computer to put the taskbar at the top. He also had his taskbar set to automatically hide, so I did that as well. Now, I don't generally recommend editing the registry, by the way. It just messes a few things up on your computer, but I did it just for this video. This meant that our pixels now line up. So, with that, he sent me the scripts, and I was able to do this for myself. Here we go. So, step for attention to Morgan's time. Yep. Spawn in at the depot. Uh, so, you go into cab view, mm -hmm. and then you want to just drag the camera, so Stepford Central, the next stop UI. And fingers crossed, you should now just be able to hold W and reach 100 miles an hour. And if I've done everything right, which I'm not entirely sure I have, <laughs> hopefully it'll work. We'll find well, out if I have or haven't in a minute. Something. We'll, we'll soon find out, shall we? The break just at the platforms. There we go. Yep. Okay, here he comes. Here's the guy, and it's got the five ready. And there we go. Oh, it just says e failed attempt to launch program. Um, that's because it says EXE and all the other ones. Now, unfortunately, this is only tested with some specific routes and can't be done everywhere. But here is a time lapse of me literally sitting back and doing nothing for a while so that you can see how well this system works.
Anyway, that's pretty much everything for this video. Of course, I won't be sharing the scripts with anyone, since neither of us want them to be used to exploit the points and experience system, but either way, this is still a really cool system, so thanks for making this dolphin. Anyway, to the rest of you, I'd like to say thanks very much for watching, I'll see you in the next video, goodbye.